welcome back to the next video and i hope this is the last video on for loop so in this video we'll be talking about delimiters so let's get started so by default the value of delimiter is space not space but space and we can change the value of delimiter according to our cells so what delimiter do it will distinguish one value from another value and in batch file you can say if we have two words a or b there's a delimiter space between it so it will create two columns indirectly column one will be holding value a and another column column two will be holding value b so let's create a folder with delimiters and let's work with another file this time so in this file we have two rows with some values and some delimiters in them so plus is one delimiter and semicolon is delimiter so what will we do first we will use the delimiter plus to separate these words and then we will use the semicolon with plus to separate the words so let's see how it works so write the syntax for for loop for double let's say g you already know what to do with that we have to specify the path specify the path that's it is it okay do open this and let's say echo and what should echo i will tell you in some time before that let's see the delimiter thing so give a space delims by default the value is space as you already saw in tokens it distinguishes between space and here let we are using plus for now as delim and with delims you need to use tokens to pick up the values actually and let's say we want to pick up we are 1 to 3 4 let's say up to 9 columns okay save it and let's print g uh, let's see what it gives and there is some error let's see what the error is token 1 to 9 del limbs g everything is correct here everything is correct so the main thing we forgot is we forgot to tell the for loop that we are working with files oh. and save this and double click on this one and Dylan's was unexpected at this time why why because we have spelled the spelling wrong Delims, D E L I M S. Hopefully, this time it works. And it, you can see A, B, C, D, and R, D are printed. So, let's see. A, B, C, D, and R, D are printed. Now you can question me why E, F, G, and T, Y, U are not printed. If you see here, echo. We have only specified to print G and as I mentioned you that it will separate into columns. So to fetch the value of TYU and EFG we have to specify the increment value for G. So if we go alphabetically A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, H I, J, K. So G now we have to use H. use um, for remainder okay so we have to use edge so edge will give us the value of this column efg and tyu so let's see that there you go and 
let's get the remaining value as well hijk and those things that will come with i save it and come here and run it now it gave us the remaining values now let's say we want to divide this based on semicolon as well so you can mention more than two delimiters also so let's say semicolon as well now what it will do it will separate everything from here because plus one we are already giving the delimiter ABCD will be separate from EFG and EFG will be separate from HIJK and now we are given the semicolon as a delimiter also now it will separate HIJK with LMNO and same goes for this one as well and same for below one let's see that so come here and you can see HIJK because we only gave GHI to echo G let's say like it G H I J K are the columns and they are holding the values A B C D E F G H I J L M N O so we have to specify G and K to get those values remaining values so let's specify that J and K and there you go we have all the values now uh, let's say we don't give 1 to 9 columns and we want only 3 columns so though we are giving the echo J and K but it won't print the values because here in the token we are saying that we only need 3 columns so it will print the value of GHI so let's check that and in echo j and k because we are given that in the echo so if you remove this thing and do it now that's working as expected uh, let's control c and let's say one two three four five let's give six and let's add one more here to be double sure are things working fine or not so we have 25 six columns but we are giving only five columns to echo so what will be the output it should output five columns it output five columns and we need to get the rest of the value as well K, L, and will it give me the numeric value as well? Yes, it does. So that was all about for loop and delimiters. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. We will meet in the next session. Thanks, guys.